So tonight's lecture kicks off what is called the Belize at 30 conference. Um, it's the last event of the uh, of the calendar of activities for in commemoration of the 30th anniversary of uh, Belize's independence. And so while we have had uh, activities to celebrate and to you know enjoy the spirit of uh, September and our independence, the, uh, tonight's event is more an educational and reflective exercise in which uh, we have asked uh, Dr. McPherson to, to speak on the, the, on the issue in which he has done the most work on the role of women, and in particular, the role of women in Belize's nationalist movement. So that kicks off our lecture tonight, and then we'll follow that with two days. It will be followed with two days of uh, lectures and presentations um, by several other Belizean individuals who have done, who have been involved in the development sectors, education, governance, and reform, um, the Guatemala claim, Belize's foreign policy, um, uh, the issue of multiculturalism and national identity. So all of these issues will be addressed over the course of the next uh, two days, tonight and then on the 21st and 22nd. So it's really to, to engage Belizeans, um, to reflect on Belize's experience with independence over the past 30 years. And we've asked our presenters to also look forward a bit, make recommendations, make projections as to where, we, where they think we're heading and what should be the steps taken so that we can develop in the way that we're meant to develop as a country. We're targeting in particular our, you know, Belize has a youthful population, about 60% of our population are considered youth. And so um, one of the things we wanted to do was to target our tertiary level institutions so that the young people become engaged and, and, and are able to acquire the knowledge from people who are involved in, in the day to day and have had the experience in terms of uh, Belize and its struggle and dealing with development since independence.